in life we're looking at how do we make a living how do we keep an earning coming into our family and when we lose our job or we lose our business we have to decide how to expend our finances what to do with our bank account and how to handle our life in my life I had a elder sibling abuse my rights to my bank literally go in and put money in or play with my accounts and they had no right to do that <clears throat> they stole federally protected documents of my bank account someone else marvelously went into my apartment and literally got into my vehicle and left a post-it note in my vehicle with the exact amount at that time which was around 10 grand that I had in my account and left that post-it amount probably dropped it in a female hand because it was a bubbly type of writing in my car and I had to wonder who got into my house because I didn't leave a key for anyone other than a family member in case I died and there was a demise that had to be discovered by a family member but that was the extent of it because my actual life my estate my legal affairs belongs to one woman she is legally liable for that when I expressed to her that I had done that she said you didn't have to do that and I said I know but I want to do that but what that means is the paltry sum that she will inherit will go to her and her children it has her name on the policy it has her children's name indicated on the policies the problem is that when I was in jail a marvelous bastard sheriff stole my journal and in that journal was my telephone numbers for those companies that have my estate affairs they also took all my papers all my legal documents all my business cards all my bank cards all my property from me and never returned it you see they just thought they'd play a game on me those marvelous white men who play in our jails